is, it's as easy as that. Got on the Nomad, the Yellowtail. Beautiful, beautiful springtime yellow. San Diego, La Jolla, let's get it bled out. Yanni knife from the rockfish episode that I was using to scale. We're gonna go ahead and pop the gills. Cut the gills on each side. Especially at the base right here. That's where you'll find the most blood. Is right there. Now that the gills are fully popped, take them here, like so. Okay. Last step here, get the yellow tail in the bag, and then we'll get the weight when we get home. All right, little tail action. Sit nicely between my legs. And we're ready to get trolling again. All right, it's starting to be a busy, busy time of the year down here. It's getting busy at the launch. Spring break, summer, spring, all that good stuff. Skiff, pick it up. Make our way through the crowd. Tide's at least going out, going down, but busy with a lot of kayaks. Oh yeah. For me, for me it's stable. For some other people, it might not be as stable. Does it good the kill bag? Oh yeah. 30 pound yellow. Really? Yep. Okay. Let's get the yellow tail now in the ice chest. We're back at it. We're back here at Summit Gas, getting some ice to put the yellow tail on ice. We'll see how much the ice they're charging. But I got some frozen large jugs that I'm gonna use to fill the bottom of my cooler at home on the in the freezer on the ice chest. And then I'll probably get, I might get three 20 pound bags. Hopefully they're not more than three or $4. Maybe I can get away with two. I'm gonna start off with two 20 pound bags. Pretty stingy right now. We'll go 40 pounds of ice. Let's get it, summit. 25 pound bag, 399. We'll go with two of them, 50 pounds. Okay, so there we got it. 42 inch long yellow tail, 30 pounds on the spring scale. Let's get it gutted. We'll get it gutted, guts put in the bag here, and then put it on ice. I always take a look inside the stomach and see what the yellowtail's been eating. So it looks like this yellowtail's been having fin bait. Not that much in his stomach. No squid either. No red crab.
now that I got the yellow tail gutted, cleaned out, I'm gonna let him rest on ice for 24 hours before filleting, filleting because that will make the fish nice and firm when I go to fillet it. Get the yellow tail on the ice, looking good. All iced up fully. We'll let it rest for 24 hours. Thank you.